actually don't know how much in frame I am, but I, I don't want to be in frame, so that's fine. I got some more gifts for myself, and uh, this I sort of spontaneously bought, which is why it's already... I bought it at a local store. And this just came in the mail, so I'm going to do a little bit of a double unboxing. It's a haul. Let's call it a haul. So these I got at a local store, and this came from Jet Pens. And it's basically all pens, which is why I figured this could go in the same bed. So, let me just move so I can see that you see what, I've, what I'm showing you. So at my local bookstore, I bought some inking pens. I'm really into inking stuff right now. So I got this, which is the SIG Calligraphy. It has like one thin and one uh, thicker end of calligraphy tips. I bought a Pigma brush pen. I have had one in the past, but it has been in sepia or brown. So that previous one I'm giving away. But this one, I just really, I, I remember liking like the feeling of the brush. So I wanted one in black too. So I'd get some use out of it. Uh, but this, which is the Pilot V sign pen. And it it's very liquidy. It has a fairly short like barrel, but if you put the cap on the end, it's not that bad. And the tip, it's, it's a very juicy pen. You can see I already dotted myself on the finger with it. Um, also got this, which I had to Google it because I wasn't sure what pen it was because it just said like, I don't know, fiber tip pen by Zebra. But it's the disposable sign pen from Zebra and it's the, it's the fine tip. It did say broad in Swedish, but they also only had like broad and fine. So I do have another one in that package that is the thinner variant. Despite this one being called, oh gosh, <laughs> despite this one being called, fine is actually pretty broad. So I'm going to have to investigate that further. Yeah, and then I got some jelly rolls. These are the jelly roll metallics in purple, green, and blue, because they are my favorite colors. So, now, to pull open this thing, shouldn't be obstructed, right? How do you like the background noise, by the way? It is raining cats and dogs today, and uh, the world just isn't letting up at all. Let's see if I can get this thing to open for me. I thought this was supposed to be easy. Okay. Let's have a look. This might actually be good to have for reference so I can tell you what is what. Okay, so Jet Pens almost exclusively sells nothing but pens. It's like they're big. Note to self, if you're filming a video, just just change the battery if you know if you know you've been filming beforehand, because the odds of it dying on you are pretty high. As I was saying, they, they are very special about their pens. They have a lot of pens to offer. And um, I find it a very easy store to navigate. They have a really nice internal sort of product comparison thing too, which I really liked for selecting my pens and stuff. Let's see. Um, this is nothing new. This is the Fudenoske in the twin tip, the black and gray. And I bought two because I really like this pen and the black end ran out really quickly. I still have the gray and I really like the gray. But I just, I want reserves and they're like really hard to find everywhere. Then I got a set of mild liners. I was tempted to just buy all of the remaining sets I don't have. I have two set previously, two sets previously, like the neon one and the sort of, I don't know. Anyway, I wanted this set because I felt like it would make a nice addition to the ones I already had. And then here are the pens. You can actually buy pre-made sets, uh, which I was tempted to do first. Like they have these uh, pen sample, pen sample sets, sampler sets. Um, but as I looked at them, there were a lot of pens I already had in both sets, so I ended up just 
sort of puzzling together pieces of each set. These two we can start with. They are the, is it zebra? Yes. These are zebra Kirarich highlighters, which are full of glitter. I have a three set from before, like the yellow, pink, and green. So I just bought the purple and blue because they're my favorite colors, but it also sort of completes my set. Then we have, let's see, I, I actually want to read because, yes. Um, here it is. This blue one, if we have a look at this one, it's, it's the same pad, but this one is the extra fine. So it's the Zebra Disposable Brush Pen. This one is actually very thin in comparison. I'm wondering if this one is actually fine. But the one they advertised as fine in the store was actually, um, was that pen, so. IDK, IDK. Then we have this here, which is the, hmm, let's see, it's the touch, so it might be, there, the Pentel Fude Touch Brush Sign Pen. And they all look the same, I realize, but I really like this sort of fiber, plasticky, not very flexible type of nib. I also have this, which is, let me see if I, it's by Pilot, that helps. It's the Pilot Fude Makase color brush pen, extra fine in black. Looks exactly the same. I really like this barrel though, it reminds me of the old CD pens. So that's that pen. And lastly, we have the, let's see, can you see it? The Kuretake Fude Gokotsu. Did I read that right? Yeah, Fude go kotsi. Fude go kotsi. Either way, it's a brush pen in the regular size and black. And they all look the same. <laughs> but I like, yes, yeah, so that was what I got in this haul. Some jelly rolls, a lot of inking tools, some highlighters, and some refills for inking tools. A lot of highlighters, actually, now that I think about it. But some refills, too, or refills replacements for old brushes that I really liked. This shipped really quickly, but I paid the ridiculously expensive FedEx shipping too. How do you like my background? Uh, you might have already seen this video or it might be going up after this one. Either way, I, I got a printer as a gift and I've been printing off a lot of gift art and com commissions, commissions, uh, art trades, uh, old contest entry stuff people have done for me in the past like there's stuff here that is I don't know five to ten years old I think so yeah I just I have a wall of art of my characters done by other people and it makes me super happy thank you so much for watching uh, this haul and uh, teaser trailer whatever for what is on the wall um, thank you for watching uh, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video which I do hope will be soon in a day or two until then Bye-bye!